air conditioning compressor wiring. Before wiring the AC compressor unit read the unit label to properly size feeder cable, disconnect, and power whip to compressor. This unit will be wired using 10 2nm Romex cable. 60 amps non-fusible pullout switch and power whip made from 3 quarters of inch non-metallic flexible conduit and 10 AW GTHHN wire. Pre-assembled power whip may be used. AC disconnect must be located within sight from and readily accessible from equipment, not farther than 50 feet. AC disconnect already installed. How to install disconnect as shown later in this video. Open AC compressor's wiring compartment. Remove disconnect front cover, pull-out handle and wiring compartment cover. Open knockouts in the disconnect and compressor unit for conduit connector installation. Measure the length of flexible PVC conduit needed for installation and cut it. Install 90 degree approved connector on one side of the conduit. Insert THHN wire into conduit.
Install straight connector on the other side of flexible conduit. Power Whip Assembly 3 pieces of THHN wire. Green, red and black, in place of red can be black, conduit connectors. Liquid tight flexible non-metallic PVC conduit. Insert wires and straight connector into disconnect knockout opening and tighten the connector's nut. Secure conduit within 12 inches from the disconnect. PVC strap and outdoor rated screws. Insert wires and connector into compressor knockout opening and tighten the connector's nut. Grounding terminal. Power, hot terminals. Trim green ground conductor for needful length, not less than 6 inches, and strip end of conductor about 1 half of inch. Terminate ground conductor to grounding lug of the unit. Trim power, hot, 
conductors for needful length, not less than 6 inches, and strip ends of conductors about one half of inch. Terminate black conductor to one of the power terminals. Terminate red conductor to other power terminal. Low voltage thermostat wiring, 182 thermostat wire, to furnace, air handler. Reinstall wiring compartment cover. Disconnect wiring. Grounding terminal. Line in, feeder, terminals. Load out, load to unit, terminals. Trim green ground conductor for needful length, not less than 6 inches, and strip end of conductor about 1 half of inch. Terminate ground conductor to grounding terminal. Trim power, hot black conductor for needful length, not less than 6 inches, and strip end of conductor about 1 half of inch. Terminate black conductor to one of the load terminals. Trim power, hot, 
red conductor for needful length, not less than 6 inches, and strip end of conductor about one half of inch. Terminate red conductor to the other terminal. Reinstall wiring compartment cover. Reinstall pullout handle, leave in off position. Reinstall disconnect front cover. Disconnect installation and termination to the panel board, example from other location. Disconnect. Halix HNF60R. Disconnect parts. Disconnect body. Front cover. Pull out handle. Wiring compartment cover. Cable already run from the load center. In this example, two disconnects for two compressors will be installed. Cable must be choose and size according to unit air compressor, label and actual NEC, National Electrical Code. Install duct seal around cable coming out of the wall. Open knockout on the back of disconnect. Install approved wire connector. Insert cable into connector and secure disconnect to the wall using outdoor rated screws. Disconnect connection terminals. Ground terminal, line terminals, load terminals, strip cables jacket, remark neutral conductor, required by NEC code when neutral is used as a hot wire, trim bare ground wire for needful length, not less than 6 inches, and terminate to ground terminal. Trim one of the hot wires for needful length, not less than 6 inches. Strip end of wire about 1 half of inch and terminate to one of the line terminals. Trim other hot wire for needful length, not less than 6 inches. Strip end of wire about 1 half of inch and terminate to second line terminal. Reinstall wiring compartment cover. Reinstall pullout handle, leave in off position. Reinstall disconnect front cover. In same way install disconnect for second air compressor if needed. If more than one AC disconnect exist in the building unit, the disconnect must be described. Feeder termination at the panel. Run properly sized cable from the panel board to the disconnect. AC compressor feeder cable. Remove panel front cover. Open panel board knockout, any available. Insert approved wire connector into the knockout. Insert feeder cable into connector. Danger! If you working near energized, live, parts of the main load center or subpanel, you must be very careful. Any accidental touching, by you or cable stripped, of any live parts of the panels may cause spark and electric shock, which may be fatal. Always de-energize panel board by turning off main breaker when it is possible. Secure cable within 12 inches of the cable entry. Strip cables jacket.
trim bare ground conductor to needful length. Reroute bare ground conductor and terminate to ground or ground, neutral terminal. Ground conductor. Remark neutral conductor. Required by NEC code when neutral is used as a hot wire, using black electrical tape or other means. Install properly sized double pole breaker. Trim hot conductors to needful length. Strip ends of conductors about one half of inch. Terminate hot conductors to the breaker. Reinstall panel's front cover. Mark installed breaker. If this video is helpful please subscribe. Comments are welcome.